the thing I hate about him, Dickie, is that, you know, he comes out here and he's always saying, I do the work of 10 people in a tenth of the time. I do the work of 10 people like it ain't shit. Well, hell, son, I can't do the work of one person in 10 times the time that he does it. But he runs around showing off. That's all he's about. He's a bragger and he shows off way too much. And I think he needs to be brought down a peg or two. That's exactly what gets me mad. Uh, this whole one-man show gimmick. What he doesn't realize is, is that the, uh, the games would be better if he didn't do the work of 10 people. Uh, the graphics would be better, the sound would be better, the music would be a damn sight better. And on top of that, the biggest tragedy uh, I imagine is that he's taking away jobs. If he swallowed his pride and shared the workload a little bit, there'd be nine other jobs. Nine. And, you know, that's the biggest tragedy here. What gets me so mad is that he puts his name on everything. The little son of a has that M. Dickey logo, that M. Dickey persona, that little M. D. son of a thing. He has it on everything, and he rubs it in. I want to see him put his name on me, little son of a If he puts his name on me, or anyone in this arena tonight, I'll kick his I'd love to see that. I'd love to see him put his name on me. sat backstage wondering exactly why I brought you on today's show. Well, let me put you out of your misery and reveal to the whole world the reason I brought you on today's show. You see, I'll make it real easy for you. You're fired! You're fired, you little What? I can't believe it. You brought me on the show to say that. All this morning, you were smiles. Hey, come on the M. Dickey Show. I got something great to tell you. I got something great to share with the whole world. Turns out you're gonna let me go? Well, you're just a no-good two-faced lying What's your problem? What's my problem? I'll tell you my problem. My problem is that I found out that you've been fraternizing with the enemy. I found out that you've been making deals on the sly with other companies. And quite frankly, I don't appreciate it. But my biggest problem is one of my star employees not doing the right thing for the business that made it not doing the right thing, quite frankly, for the employees and the management that got him where he is today. You're a cold, bitter piece of shit. You know that? If you can't have me, nobody can. Is that your deal? Well, you know what? I see you brought me out on TV hoping that I wouldn't make a big deal, hoping that I wouldn't make a scene. Well, you know what? You chose the wrong show for that. You see, the M. Dickey Show is all about making a scene. It's all about justice and getting what's coming to you. That's exactly what's going to happen right now. You want to fight? I'll give you a fight. You want to take my job? I'll take your life.
shop. I think you're lying. I'm a substitute teacher from uh, from Britain over in America at the moment, and but well, everyone everyone knows the British education system is the best in the world, and I'm trying to bring that over to the American students and trying to enlighten them, but they won't have it. They've all become so lazy and insolent, and quite frankly, I find it disgusting. You know what? I don't really give a damn. You know what? I'm 16 years old. I don't care. You know, I just want to sit home all day playing them dicky games. I just got Federation Booker. I'm f***ing addicted to it. I just want to play that. You can shove your homework up your ass. Oh, yeah. Well, you know, as I was saying, in Britain we have the best education system in the world. And one of the beauties of that system is a little something I call spanking. It's when we take our hands to ungrateful students, to insolent students, and teach them a lesson or two. And I'd be more than happy to give you a lesson and a preview of it right here on the M. Dickey Show. Oh, oh you're going to kick my I'd like to see you try, old man. You know what? Why do you think we're here? We're here because I kicked your in math last Tuesday. You were spouting all this British shit again, and I kicked your with that damn cane. I'm gonna do it again right now. I've got more. I've got small for choice for weapons right here, old dude. I'm gonna kick your just like on those wrestling TV shows. I'll be more than happy to give you a lesson.
British education system is the best in the world.